Welcome guys, one more video for the channel and the situation around the world is crazy I don't want to talk about that but I just want to say that here the place where I'm staying, the place where I live is it's abandoned, there's no more tourists, empty beaches, hotels are closed and everything so it looks everything like a desert. I can walk the beach and see nobody laying or under an umbrella, nothing. But good fishing. And I found out there's a lot of people fishing right now because they're trying to get some fish to put in the fridges. And that's smart. And I just decided to make a video because you were like, asking for. So, Let's see how this video is at the end of, uh, of the day. Hope you like. So let's have fun. Be safe everyone. guys so as you can see everything is empty there's nobody on the beach or the restaurants and what we're doing right now with my friend is we're staying in one spot one of these empty places and just waiting for those surfers Creval Jack Creval and right here you can see the professional fisherman from Argentina <laughs> so we're staying right here and this is the view we have from here we just staring at the waves and when we see the big revolve surfing we just run and try to catch them so hopefully get some fish at the end of the day and so you can watch some uh, fly fishing videos Bacon, part of the family of the village where I live. She likes to be rubbed in the belly. Well, bacon. <laughs> Alright, guys, this is not the only thing I do in this place. Now I'm going for windsurfing to teach to some of my neighbors in this quarantine. You have to do something. So I'm gonna do some lessons and let's go in the water. Sometimes I go slow. Other days I go fast.
guys, this is the third day. Tried to catch a jack rebel, but I haven't seen really much. Not really much action. My friend was trying to get one on the fly, but nothing. Today I've been watching the wave walking beach and I haven't seen any, any jack. So I'm going back home, do something else. And I hope you like the video. Enjoy. Didn't catch any fish at the end of the day. But it was good to be out there. make it at the end of the day over there those buildings is where I'm going that is the bay so at least I'm gonna spend like 40 minutes to get there on a sail so I'll keep recording later okay guys I'm getting closer to the place I can see that island there of rock that's a rock island so just in between the land there's a canal so I can get through there. Uh, I hope to make it. <laughs> I've never been there on a winter like going through the canal, but I'm gonna just look around. Okay, going through the canal. Yeah, I think I can make it. It's not that difficult. I was expecting a little bit tougher, but it is fine. The wind's kind of dying because of the rocks here. Probably my lure is going to get stuck in a rock. For sure. How about to touch the bottom with the fin? Ooh, look at the fish. <laughs> catch anything on the way but I got to the spot I'll fish I gotta get my boots on and everything a new battery to my camera and I'll be ready yeah get my boots on a trigger fish coming I don't know if you see it cruising in the way right there Getting my rod ready. Let's hopefully catch something. This little guy. Okay, I found some bones here. Very shallow water. How they eat that? Come on, bone. Take it, take it. Oh no, it saw me. Oh, 
Oh, it's a rock. Hmm. I caught this monster. What's this little guy? Big snapper. <laughs> These guys are very aggressive. Hey guys, I've been watching for a while. I've been here fishing and the fish is very picky right now. No permits by the way. I look, I look everywhere. No tails, no flashes, nothing. But I'll be back in another day. Today I saw many bones, but they were so picky. Also the trigger fish, the little ones, they were so picky. Well, the only thing I have is to go back, rolling, and hopefully hook a barracuda or something to eat. Well, let's, let's go windsurfing again. Oh, I got a fish on! It's a macro or something like that. I saw three sailfish right under under the the board. I was sailing over there, trolling the thing, and yeah, can't believe. All right, let's head back. Probably try a different. Yeah, I'm gonna try a different fly. Look at this, guys. I found these two big turtles having, you know, <laughs> having this intimate moment. So they having, they making kind of laugh, you know? This three, three of them, look, together, having fun. They're just having fun, look at that. <laughs> I just took them. Oops. Oh, no. No, 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 no. My lure is over there. Wow, three turtles making you know that time glorious. All right. My tail. This is a big board I use for school to teach my friends. And I was trolling a big rod and I got a few um, bonitos like tuna similar and the first tuna i got i start running my sail again and behind me because of the blood of the bonito because i kill it a big sailfish was was chasing the lure that is a fly i made so i tied the fly and it's working really well unfortunately i'm not able to to turn my camera side to the to decide where the, the fly is going but the sail is there chasing the fly they strike a few times but the drag didn't didn't hook that fish but it was running on the drag hopefully at the end of this video land that fish or at least fight for a few seconds i don't know we'll see anyway i have some food to take home and i hope you like this fishing style yeah. Gotta go back again. There's so many bonitas surfing right now. Woohoo! About this fish, guys.
bonito. Ah. Oh, fish. Got this fish. Pretty nice. I'll bring it home. Definitely. We're eating. So, yeah. All right, guys, I think I'm killing it. I got a second one. First, second. Pretty nice fish. I'll keep him for eating. Come on, tailfish! Come get a fly! Woohoo! I'm far away from the cut. I don't know if you get to see. I'm way, way out. This is collagic fishing. This is the fly I was using there. This fly makes everything possible today, for today. And here is the result. I got this little guy and the other one was bigger. So I'm making some slices to storage for next day's eat in this quarantine. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. This is the end of it. I just want to say that I'm having a good time in my quarantine and probably not fair because probably you live in a different situation in a different country. But thanks God I'm staying in this place and I'm able to record and I'm able to still do some content for the channel. I had a great time fishing today. I sliced my fish, put it into the fridge. The big storm just passed. We don't have electricity right now because the wind messed up all the electricity cables and pumps and a mess. Well, at least I have some light so I can, I can say goodbye to everyone. Beautiful experience with this sailfish chasing my fly. I slice my fish, storage into the fridge and I'll be fine for at least a couple weeks or maybe maybe one but guys thank you very much have fun do something productive and uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel hit that subscribe button it's free and turn that notification bell on so you will know when i'm when i'm posting a new video follow this channel if you like the content and see you in the next video guys bye